Welcome back to the challenge. Now that we've spotted some opportunities and taken stock of what resources we have and can access, it's time to start ideating, or as some might call it, brainstorming. In this video, we'll walk you through this ideation process, and then we'll help you to filter and decide what to work on. Let's get to it, and let's start with ideating. We like to use the word ideating because sometimes the word brainstorming makes it sound like it needs to be super active with a lot of people, ideas flying around. The output is the same though. We will guide you through a process to come up with a bunch of ideas inspired by the opportunities you spotted and the vision of your desired state, guided by the resource mapping that you've done. The main difference is the method. Instead of being in a group with people discussing and potentially talking over each other, you will be ideating on your own. But of course, you can do this with friends as well. If you have friends who are also doing this challenge, it's definitely more fun to work on things together. You can ideate on your own, together. This ideation exercise works best if you've already completed the first few challenges on opportunity spotting and the resource bullseye. If you haven't watched those videos or completed those challenges, I would suggest that you check them out first. If you're ready to get going, it would be handy to have the worksheets that you completed on standby. Now, this ideation exercise will help to answer the question of what can I do to achieve this desired state? The desired state being the opportunity that you spotted. For example, the issue you identified was maybe that your neighbors don't really interact with each other. Your desired state is for them to interact more. Now, how might we get there? This is the question that this exercise aims to answer. How might we get to your desired state or desired states? You might want to also think about your resource mapping exercise to guide your ideation. Now, let's say that you've identified that you have access to a cool common area in your neighborhood. And you also identify that you have friends who can cook and friends who love to entertain, they're in a band. And what if you organized a weekly potluck for your neighbors to interact more with each other? That's an idea already. Using your desired state, plus the resources that you have mapped, you can come up with several ideas to achieve your desired state. You can use the worksheet on the Lien Center website to continue ideating on your own. If you're doing this with your friends, feel free to discuss with them and ask if you can tap into their resources too.